Update driver. Step 1. Press Windows key, type dvmgmt.msc, and hit Enter to open Device Manager. Step 2. Expand Display Adapters, right-click your graphics card, and pick Update Driver. Step 3. Hit Search Automatically for Updated Driver Software. Step 4. The moment the process completes, restart your computer. Step 5. When the screen comes back on, press Windows plus I to open Settings. Go to System and look for Advanced Display Settings in Display. Note, on occasions, it's wise to uninstall and reinstall the display driver. To do so, open Device Manager, locate your graphics card in Display Adapters, right-click it, and pick Uninstall Device. Afterward, Check the checkbox next to delete the driver software for this device. Hit OK and restart your computer. Disable the onboard graphics card. Step 1. Open Device Manager, right-click the onboard graphics card in Display Adapters, and pick Disable Device. Step 2. Restart your computer. Step 3. Witness the result. Run Hardwari and Device Troubleshooter. Step 1. Open Settings, select Update and Security and choose a troubleshoot. Step 2. Click Additional Troubleshooters. Pick Hardwary and Devices, then hit Run the Troubleshooter. Step 3. If the troubleshooter manages to offer a fix for the issue, hit Apply this fix. Step 5. See how things turn out. Note. You fail to find the Hardware and Devices troubleshooter? In that case, press Windows key. Type CMD and hit Run as administrator. Next, run the command msdt.xe, ID device diagnostic in command prompt, admin. Use system restore. Step 1. Press the Windows key, type system restore, and hit Enter. Step 2. Select system restore, choose a restore point, and initiate the restoration. Step 3. The moment the process completes, determine whether the issue persists. Clean install windows. Step 1. Launch your web browser, visit Microsoft's official website, and download the media creation tool from the software download page. Step 2. After the download finishes, run the tool once prompted. Step 3. Read the terms and conditions. Check the checkbox beside I accept the license terms and hit Next. Step 4. Choose Upgrade this PC now, then select Next. Step 5. Uncheck the checkbox beside Keep Personal Apps and Files, then hit Install. Once the installation concludes, create a new user account and accept the terms. Last but not least, Sign in to your account and determine whether the issue persists.